I think I've definitely changed over the course of the four years. I think I came into college like anybody a little bit clueless. I didn't know what I wanted to do. I didn't know what my major was going to be. I took a whole slew of classes that I wasn't interested in at first. And then getting involved in the program and getting passionate about something was something I hadn't, I hadn't done before. I hadn't ever planned on getting involved in something and being so in depth and meeting so many other people who have that in common with me. So I think that definitely changed my outlook on, on myself and on the campus, I guess. Coming into the degree, I wish I knew how involved I was going to get with it. Um, I think I, I was interested in it, but I really thought that I was just going to end up taking my classes and doing my labs and going home at the end of every day and it ended up being a lot more than that. I ended up interning twice in the course of this year. I ended up being a founder of the Seeds Club. I ended up doing a ton of community service on campus and I just, I love it and I didn't think I was going to be as involved as, it, as I am. I'm a firm believer in doing what's good for your community and if everybody does that, that it really helps the world and we have so many people on this campus and in this major who are so involved in making this community a better place environmentally and in other ways and so I think that by us making our community a better place that we're ultimately making the world a better place. I actually chose environmental studies after already being in school for two years undeclared. Um, taking the class food health and the environment was really what ultimately made me choose it. it does a really good job in the class of telling you how the environment really relates to your everyday life rather than being a little bit too intense so it gives you a really great introduction of how the program is going to work. What I enjoy most about the environmental studies program is all the opportunities that they offer you within the program. Um, you get a range of sciences and policy and there's a ton of internship opportunities. I've interned two times through Keene State, once with Dr. Flieger and the Harris Center for Conservation Education doing conservation land surveying. And I'm currently working in Dr. Nora Travis's lab doing biodiesel and diesel lung cell research. In environmental studies, I feel like I've never had a hard time getting in touch with a professor. A lot of times they're very laid back. I have a really easy time just knocking on the door and walking into their office or emailing them and getting an immediate response. They're really good about not only helping you with the classes that you're in, but a lot of the professors also allow you to reach out to them even if you don't have them that semester. So we do have lecture-based learning in the environmental studies major, but we also do a lot of hands-on learning. So they directly prepare us for our career by splitting our degree into part policy and part science classes. So for the policy you take classes like environmental governance, environmental law and regulation, and then for the science aspect you take your general sciences and then you're also going to take a lot of classes which directly apply to real world, real world disasters and real world effects of what we're doing to the planet currently. So this semester in my senior seminar we have eight of us who are creating a conservation plan for the city of Keene and in turn we're each creating a project that has to do with that which may have to do with education or um, water storage or invasive species within the city so personally I am completing a series of three lesson plans for the new Keene Middle School outdoor classroom and that is a lesson plan regarding interconnectedness of ecosystems and things like that that connect to 6th, 7th, and 8th grade science curriculum. I can't see myself doing anything else. Um, the only other thing that I'm interested in is teaching and that's the reason that after Keene State College I'm hoping to go to graduate school for environmental education in order to help other people learn about these things that I just recently learned about and it's changed me so much so I feel like other people should learn about it too.